hello everyone uh, we get the same problem uh, as we are getting in uh, ubuntu 18.04 uh, the touchpad and uh, the wi-fi is not working out of the box so uh, uh, and i uh, see a performance issue there uh, as there where in ubuntu 18.04 uh, the booting time is uh, taking um, ages, and uh, uh, the moment uh, the uh, file transitions or any operation in basic operations also uh, lagging, uh, and uh, it's it's not as smooth as compared uh, to uh, the other system we have. So I decided to put in the Linux Mint uh, latest uh, uh, version and uh, I can see a, a better performance way, way better than the Ubuntu 18.04 uh, on this Lenovo IdeaPad 330 uh, and uh, but yes uh, we do have the same problem uh, out of the box uh, we do not have uh, uh, our touchpad and Wi-Fi issue solved uh, so uh, and it's basically because uh, these uh, drivers are not included in the mainline kernel of uh, Linux Mint latest version of Linux Mint so uh, what we have to do is uh, we have to uh, uh, the latest version of Linux Mint uh, is having 4.15 uh, kernel version so uh, uh, the touchpad driver is uh, Elantech touchpad that is being used on this laptop is being uh, is a driver b uh, being uh, ported to the uh, ported to the mainline kernel from 4.18 version. So uh, you have to upgrade uh, your uh, kernel, and you can follow the other video where I have said uh, I have. Uh, know like uh, demonstrated uh, like how to upgrade uh, uh, the kernel uh, in both the ways like using the command line interface or using the uh, uku uh, kernel uh, updater utility uh, then you what you have to do is uh, once you uh, update your kernel reboot your system start using the new kernel your touchpad should work out of the box if it is not uh, working uh, then go to uh, the uh, source go to the uh, mouse uh, in the drivers and then put in the file I have given in uh, my blog uh, you just have to uh, uh, pull that file uh, file and put in uh, like duplicate that file uh, from the source and put in there and uh, reboot your system your uh, touchpad should uh, uh, working should be working so uh, then now uh, uh, for the Wi-Fi what you have to do is you have to uh, uh, you have to install the build essentials and uh, uh, then you have to clone that particular uh, 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 clone that uh, uh, particular uh, branch and uh, uh, then you have to make that uh, uh, make the script executable and uh, run that script uh, once that script is uh, uh, complete uh, once that script is complete uh, you will have to reboot your system and your wifi should uh, be should be running uh, i hope uh, i would i'd be able to help someone uh, so if you like this video if i am able to help you please do subscribe and do like my channel thanks